there, it's Chris Kramer coming to you today from Miami City Ballet, and I'm here with former principal dancer Jan Trividic. And uh, welcome back, Jan, as a guest artist this season, That's right? right? That's right. So I'm very curious, You've, you left back in 2004. That's right. To, and so what have you been doing for five years? All right, I went back to school um, in France to study osteopathy. Yeah. And um, I just uh, went through the, my last exam um, a month ago. Yeah, congratulations. So I just graduated, yeah. <laughs> career number two, right? Career number two and uh, back to career number one for a couple of months. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So that's really exciting. I mean, you've been away for five years. How, how much have you danced in five years? Um, don't tell Adrian. No, you can be honest. Come on. <laughs> All right. Well, about <laughs> one class every two or three months. Yeah, wow. <laughs> wow. Well, Jan and I used to dance together, so... Um, you know, it's kind of amazing though because I've taken very few classes, but in ways it's kind of like a lot comes back to you, right? Well, the the um, the strength is not there anymore. Exactly. But there's stuff that comes back really fast. Yeah, and you're like, wow, I can still do that, and I'm still good, right? No, <laughs> no, no. But it, you know, like working with the with the partners and the girls, yeah. and um, it, it comes after two rehearsal already. Yeah. Come, come back. Yeah. yeah. Came back. Yeah, that's cool. Mm -hmm. That's cool. You're sore though, right? Very sore. <laughs> yeah. Did you do any like prep? Because you were over in France. So did you do any like prep before coming to Miami? Like do a little crash course and like taking a lot of classes or anything well, like yeah, that? Well, yeah, I, I tried to uh, stretch a lot. I mm -hmm. did some running for the stamina and yeah. I took some classes. But yeah. I didn't have much time. Yeah. So I just did that last month. Oh, exactly. Right. Exactly. It's not, it's not too bad. Not hurt, you know. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta take it easy, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Wow, so you're doing like basically like a crash course of rehearsals for a month, you told me. That's right. Right. A month rehearsal with everybody. Uh huh. And then um, go back four months to France, yeah. do my job, yeah. you know, practice in my office. And then I come back in January for two months yeah. one month rehearsal yeah. and one month performance. Wow. And for those of you who don't know, we're talking about the neighborhood ballroom, Edward Valella's. Um, ballet that he choreographed and Jan when he choreographed it he choreographed it on you yep um, and you were the lead role as the poet that's right so I mean how did it come about that I mean did he just like call you and we're like we need you back we're bring back the ballroom well it was really funny because uh, I came back from uh, school one day yeah. and uh, one night and uh, Suzanne my girlfriend yeah she who was also in the company used to be in the company He's, right. he stole her to go to France I know. <laughs> and uh, she uh, left me a note saying um, with like a, a, um, a pair of tights on the hanger, and it says, <laughs> and it said, um, if you if you call that number, you may uh, need a, lo a lot more of these soon. And I was like, really? Yeah. That's so funny. So I called, and he was edited, and he told me, okay, uh, what about uh, coming back to do ballroom? And I was like, mm, yes. <laughs> I didn't think twice. I was like, let's do it. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's a great opportunity, though. I think. I mean, I think it's really fun. It's gonna be a little challenge, right? You know, getting back in shape and everything. And, yeah. But you know, it's somewhere there in your body. All that choreography that you've done and all the years of dancing, it's it's there in your body. It somewhere. came back so, pretty fast. Yeah, exactly. So I mean, how cool is that? You know, you're, you're gonna be in France with your new practice and everything, then you come back here, do some performances, I, and. Uh, I'm just really lucky. It's a good transition between school and you know practicing. Yeah. And I kind of miss being on stage. Yeah. You know, and uh, I think it's perfect. You yeah. know, it just ends my dance career. Yeah. For, forever. Yeah. And I keep on thinking, um, you know, Edward did that in his career at one point. He had uh, he had left and then he yeah came back he to came back piece several years later. Yeah, uh, Robin's piece, I think. Yeah. Jim Robin's. I think it was like windmill or something. Yep, yeah, it was. I don't want to say because I'm not accurate. No, on what I think I'm gonna it, say. I think it was, but he was. I think he did it like a little older, like at four years old or yeah. forty five. Yeah, we'll have to get the details on that. Yeah. But uh, I did keep on thinking about that. So it's very cool. It can't be too bad, though. You know, a little bit of Miami, a little bit of France. Uh, exactly. Yeah, so very cool. Mm -hmm. Well, Jan, welcome back. And, Thank you very uh, much. And we look forward to talking to you throughout the year, okay? Okay, no problem.